Well, Jonathan, it was another great show, man. I tell you, it was a pleasure having my son, Josh, in studio here. Josh, uh, glad to have you on the team with Southeastern Land Group. Hey, thanks for having me. Glad uh, to be here. Uh, you're our newest agent. I hope you can make it a couple months. I hope so. <laughs> I, hope so. <laughs> no, I, I hope it's going to be as good a career for, for you as it is me. We're excited to see what Josh is going to do in Northwest Alabama. Uh, had Ryan Folk on, a great friend of the show, one of our sponsors, uh, Land Flip, Land Think Network. Uh, we just talked about some of them, maybe the – some of the positive impact markets uh, with people being shut up and thinking about maybe shut in, shut in, and <laughs> not right. shut up, shut in, <laughs> and thinking about maybe uh, uh, getting out and buying a piece of property there. Yeah. And uh, hey, and this this magazine is great. We had a great guest on here. We this, did. This is, this is the Alabama Forest Magazine, uh, Alabama Forestry Association. You yeah, tell me about it. we did. We had uh, Mr. Chris Isaacson, who's the executive vice president of the Alabama Forestry Association, on talked about all the great things that are happening uh, in our forest products industry around the state and you know some some great things some things that are challenges right now but it's so important to the economy of Alabama uh, all the way from the landowner to the to the finished product so we really appreciate mr. Isaacson being on today yeah and they even did uh, they even did an article here about a you know there's a couple of ugly guys that did this land show thing so they, did they were struggling for they were for a yeah. guest this week. so we should have had Josh in that picture he would have proved it <laughs> But then we went to Russ, did our, our uh, no, no, we did, we went to William. Well, we talked to Josh. Yeah, we talked to Josh, and then we already talked about Josh, so Josh got enough air time. <laughs> All right, so then we went to William William Lyon with Southeastern Estates. Uh, William did a, does a tremendous job with smelt, selling uh, 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 small farms, homes, and we just talked about that market. William does a great job. And that they're hammering all the turkeys over in Lowndes County. There you go. And then we wrapped it up with Russ Walters down in Andalusia, Covington County, and he talked about they're seeing what we've heard from people all around the state today is just that there's a big demand for a lot of small properties right now. People want to get out in the country. They want to have a small piece of land where they can grow their food or stretch their legs or whatever you want to do. So, you know, I'm glad to hear that there's still demand for a lot of these properties. Yeah, and uh, appreciate y'all watching this this, this short uh, review of the show and hope you'll listen to the rest of the podcast. And always, thanks for listening to The Land Show with David Johnny.